halfway through their Phuket holiday, our travel guides have landed in Party Central. There's just energy bouncing off every wall. But will Patong's full-on red light district win them over or freak them out? I don't even know where to, like, go. I want to go everywhere. I was completely glazed over, just in just general overstimulation. I was like, oh. Which, for Monty's, very hard to be overstimulated. Bangla Road is all about sex shows, cheap drinks and loud music. You know what's really wrong about this street? Yeah. It's all the people trying to get us to go into these sex parties. What is wrong with you? Wake up to yourself. Do you know what you're selling? You're out of line. If I came down with my boys, I would definitely love to go and party there. Would you come here for your anniversary? anniversary. Yeah. Yeah, I'll come now for my anniversary. I don't mind. Yeah? yeah. Unbelievable, man. Seriously, sorry. No. I'm fine with music. I love music. I love dancing. I love fun. And no, I didn't like Bangla Road. No. And I would not feel comfortable for anyone that I know to come here. Don't like it. It's not for us, mate. Bangla Road's also the native environment of Thailand's third sex, the glamorous lady boys. I think that's a positive thing for Thailand, that they're so accepting of people who are different. How many men, straight men, are a bit confused about the lady boy look? How beautiful are Thai women? Look how gorgeous they are. And people obviously love it, you know? Nearly the entire street are lady boys. I think some people have been confused. Yeah. You girls look so gorgeous. I love it. <laughs> it really didn't hit me until one of the locals pointed out that not just one of them was a boy, but all of them. 